Good afternoon or good morning guys. Welcome to welcome back to another episode of Reacting to Funny Animals. So we have some special segments here going on, but I just gotta show you something. She's joining me today, sort of, not really. She's just a little bit sleepy pants and that's okay with me. Because when she's awake, her energy is wild. So so let's get to the first one. Um, I have a question for the professionals out there that, uh, also my nose is red because of my stuffiness last yesterday. Um, I have a question for all of those who have, who are professionals of editing. I would love to hear, um, how you do it, like how you make them better, how you add in like those funny, like, um, those funny meme guys that are trend that, that always trend or um or adding in like a like a theme song kind of I'm curious to know okay let's get into it okay number one jungle cats versus mirrors oh <laughs> wait a minute that's me why aren't you fighting back Photography Fernley Mark Fernley set up mirrors in the Amazon rainforest to capture animals' reactions. I'm too tired to fight any. <laughs> oh. What is this? You look very pretty. Do you want to be my friend? That big cats had mixed feelings after failing to recognize their reflections. What the. <laughs> Who are you? <laughs> it starts getting mad at it. Oh. I guess I guess wild animals would really never see themselves in a mirror unless they, they live in a house but that has mirrors in them, but I don't know. What do you guys think of that one? I'm curious of your thoughts. Ivy doesn't really care, she's sleeping, so Okay, number two. This is why you should never surprise a bear. <laughs> oh, oh, oh my god, oh my. <laughs> and off it goes. I don't want to look at myself. No, thank you. <laughs> I already spooked him. That's funny. Um, it's almost like he was like low self-esteem. I don't want to look at myself. Gotta go, you gotta go. No, nah, probably not. That was funny though. On to number three. Number three looks like we have a mirror theme going. Watch what happens when our dog oh, herself sees the mirror. Her, I, watch what happens when our dog sees herself in the mirror. I can't believe I got this on video. Oh. <laughs> She was not impressed that a German Sheppy came along with the house. <laughs> what, <Well>, herself? <laughs> Aww. They just bought a house and wanted to let her sniff around. Aww, it's always a blessing when you get to do that, eh? Aww. Cute. Must protect my humans from crazy mirror doggo. <laughs> oh my gosh. They're like, that's you. That's you! <laughs> I love it. I love it. My dog's done that before. All my dogs are like, what is this? Who is this? Is this me? But I think they kind of understand after a while. I wonder, actually. I'm curious to know. Oh, a sleepy head over here. But when she wakes up, she's the devil, so... <laughs> I'm kidding. She's she's a total sweetheart. Okay, on to number four. Okay, so we're on number four. Okay, let's go. When you, your dog sees himself in the mirror, <laughs> just stares, staring away at himself. <laughs> That's cute. Oh. He like got excited or scared. I couldn't tell. That was that's funny though. Oh, he looks happy. He looks happy. I love I love dogs. 
Um, so my dog, we have a seatbelt for her. It looks like this girl's holding onto her collar while she drives. I don't know for sure, but we had to have a seatbelt. But before, when she was just a little puppy, I think she was maybe like almost a little over one, maybe or no, she was like. No, no, no. She was like six months or something. Or just eight months. Anyways, doesn't matter. She would sit in my lap on my way to the boulevard before we went for our RUN. Or like to, to a park. And I'm like, okay, we can't keep doing this because I could get into trouble. So she would go be in the back seat. And she still does this, but she climbs up to the back window on the, the ledge thing behind the back seats that kind of, you know what I mean? And she'll just lay there. It's, it's hilarious. That's like one of her favorite spots. My dog is going berserk. Okay, let's do another video. I don't know what number we're on because I got distracted here. Sorry. Um, oh, if it's brown, lay down. Ooh. Are they like camouflaged then to the bear? That's curious. That's interesting. There we go. She's relaxing now. <laughs> I mean, she's been relaxing all morning, but this this guy, this delivery guy, I'm I'm watching him come up my stairs, and I'm like, hold, I'm like closing her eyes like don't see this guy please don't see him because <laughs> they'll bark their heads off and he had to knock on the door he had to knock on the door just like don't knock on the door please and it's not like a bad thing he's just letting us know that the package is there but my dogs go berserk and they're they're, they're reactive they're not aggressive um they just bark a lot anyone anyone have any tips on that by the way i'm curious <laughs> Uh, about that about my dog barking all the time by the way so if you have any please let me know we're talking to each other and this is what I found what's happening what's going on what is this meeting about just Thor giving them by their names Apollo what's going Aurora on. That's so funny. they were talking to each some sketchy meeting going on that's for sure that's funny. I love it. <laughs> um, this guy has three huskies. I would love to know what your thoughts on huskies. Are they are they all dramatic like they say they are? I'm curious. Puts up on and nowhere you're surrounded by a pack of wild dogs. It's a lot of wild dogs. I'd bring them all home. It says in the caption, what would you do? Bring them all home or run away? I'd bring them all home. I would. And then I'd figure it out after that. What, do you, what would you guys do? I know like some people are allergic. Some people don't like dogs, which I don't understand you. If you don't like dogs, you are scary to me if you don't like dogs. But that's it. <laughs> uh, uh uh no 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 she's la she's like I gotta bark at everything Here's the last one Stop phone the realized white grizzly bear was beside me Oh my god look how huge that guy is Oh wow He is massive You are dead if you ever got in his way So luckily he was eating and you couldn't you know you, you couldn't get in his way, but still, that's pretty scary. That's a scary situation. I don't know how I would feel about that at one bit. Like, that is scary to me. But that is it for you, for us today. Um, what would you do if you caught, um, if you were caught beside a grizzly bear? I, like, I would just rush back into my car. That's where I think you're the safest. Um, again, grizzly bears are, I believe, way more strong than our brown bears here in uh, Ontario. Um, we got to learn a little bit when I was in Banff with my boyfriend and I. We went to Banff back in August, and we got to learn quite a bit about grizzly bears. And they are, they seem a lot scarier. 
but that is it for me you guys have an awesome rest of your day uh, a good weekend. It's Friday. Woohoo for Fridays for the ones who work Monday to Fridays and for the ones who work shift. Well, you'll have a few days off soon, hopefully. Anyways, have an awesome rest of your day. Bye now.